As today we are learning about the conversion of meter into millimeters, so let us recall about the meter. A meter is a metric unit of measure. You can use a meter stick to measure meters. If you stretch out both your arms, the length between them is approximately a meter long. A meter is an appropriate unit to measure the length of a baseball bat, a table, the height of a door and even your own height because we always measure our height in form of meters. Let us recall about millimeter. A millimeter is the, a metric unit of measure. You can use a ruler to measure millimeters. In the ruler, there are the small lines that are used for millimeters. Look at this line. The height of it can be measured using centimeters, but the thickness of it is about a millimeter wide. A millimeter is an appropriate unit to measure the thickness of a coin, the opening of a straw, the length of a grain of rice and the length of an ant. Now let us learn that how we can convert between meters and millimeters. One meter is equals to thousand millimeters and one millimeter is equals to one thousandth of a meter. And in the decimal form it is 0 0.001. Because when we convert a fraction that has 1000 in the denominator, we have to put the decimal point in that. Here are some examples where we are converting the meters into millimeters. So in all we have to multiply by 1000. You can use the standard algorithm to multiply or you can add three zeros on the right of the number and move the decimal three times to the right. Because whenever we multiply a decimal by thousand, we have to move the decimal point by three places to the right. So here are some examples like 5 meters, 72 meters, 8.94 meters, 0 0.3 meters, 0 0.109 meters and in all the cases we have to multiply it by 1000. If we have the whole number we have to multiply with the 1000 we can add 3 zeros with that number and in the decimal as I told you that if you are multiplying by 1000, so in 1000 there are 3 zeros, it means we have to move the decimal point 3 digits towards the right side. Like here 6.2, if we are multiplying 6.2 by 1000, so we have to move the decimal point towards the right side uh, after 3 digits. So here we have only one digit, so we can add two zeros by ourselves 